but my name's Dermot Hickson and I'm from a very uh, little known part of the world in South Derry called uh, Newbridge. It's about halfway between Belfast and Derry. So this summer the uh, Department of Infrastructure announced they were going to be um, going to proceeding with, uh, with plans to build a dual carriageway and motorway essentially through um, this part of the world. So, so Ramsar designated wetland, um, it's an ASSI and uh, it's a national nature reserve and it's, uh, it's somewhere that's been a great source of inspiration to me growing up. I always look back at this place as being somewhere that's give, that, that has made me care about you know, things beyond humanity. E each of these fields around here has a, has a different story. Farmers, they might have been the landowners but we always saw ourselves as the, as the custodians. Imagine 22,000 cars a day um, hurtling past behind us here. Um, it's such a gentle and tranquil part of the world that doesn't bear thinking about. I mean, The Strand at Loch Beg is, is the title of a poem by Seamus Heaney. You know, he, he, he wrote uh, very uh, longingly about the, the landscape around here, which seemed to be turned to fiction by, the, by this development of the, of the A6. This landscape is global heritage. It's an artistic heritage. It's a, it's a cultural heritage that you know, belongs to not just the people around Ockram Hill or you know the Ockram Lane. You know, belongs to you know County Derry. Belongs to Northern Ireland. It belongs to Ireland. It belongs to Europe. It belongs to anyone who's ever connected to the the, the themes of what James Heaney talks about. The decision to proceed with this route and this particular stretch of the road is a, is a travesty, and um, when there were other routes available that weren't even ass assessed, and that's and that's kind of what the mo most galling thing is about about this entire. Um, development and they decided to railroad through this area despite all the um, environmental implications and, and, the, and the cultural heritage implications. And there needs to be another environmental impact assessment done. The, the, it, it speaks volumes really about the direction of our, uh, of our country and our, and our society really when a road regardless of consequence has become more important than like a major part of our identity um, which is our cultural heritage and, and our landscape.